The freezing temperatures could not come at a worse time for one group of homeless people in Chicago. They've been living at a hotel for a year, but now they're being forced out. Tia Ewing live with more on that story. Tia. Well, the city says since they started renting rooms at Hotel Julia and 450 people have come in and out. Tonight we met a woman who's being forced out. She's getting back on her feet. She just started a job program, but is now forced back into a temporary shelter. Latrice Madison is being forced to relocate after calling Hotel Julian home for 120 days. During me uh, being homeless, um, I was sent here. The city of Chicago was footing the bill, renting 175 rooms for the homeless starting in February of 2021 because of the pandemic. I've been here for about nine months. But two weeks ago, some residents, according to Madison, were told they had to go with very little to no warning. People was getting knocked on the door um, the next day after the mandatory meeting. The city of Chicago's Department of Family and Support Services did respond to that claim, saying, quote, some shelter beds have become available before the final move out date of February 25th. In November of 2021, city council extended a deal to pay more than $500,000 a month for some of the city's homeless to be housed here. Add it all up and that's $6 million for one year. The city did not say it became too costly, but residents say it came down to one big issue. Funding. So funding being the big issue there, the city says that they did use partnerships to relocate 172 people. They say that no one was relocated and just tossed out. They all had somewhere to go. Live tonight, Tia Ewing, Fox 32 Chicago.